Oh man, he's he can't decide. Claudio Serafino. Mm. And very rarely, I mean, I remember we were in Lahore, Pakistan, and my man pulled out the Oscar for a tournament. But here we go. <laughs> Yo, Florida, this is the first match at top eight. Let's make some noise for Tekken 8, y'all. Let's get into it. CEO 2024. Game number one. Dojin versus Al Claudio versus Elisa, the back one. You love that move. Of dude. course. Who doesn't? Simple punish Another right there. Another one. Mm -hmm. Great option to uh, check the tracking. Gets the starburst power up. Yeah, that forward 2-2 two, two punish, but speaking of forward twos. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, tries to duck, gets hit by the mid. That chainsaw destruction stance. This is why I say she's one of those characters kind of like snuck by, right? Because she's mm -hmm. still really strong with that destruction stance. And not a lot of clean counterplay to call it out. Defense looking really good for Dojin so far though. Yeah, life is not even, but the low pokes gonna get it. Dojin, round number one. Yeah, those side step four starting to add up as well. Like I said before, Kind of using Al Ooh. game against him with the pokes, but the hop kick here from Al. Yeah, calls out the running two, ducks the high, gets the launch. Walk here, just a little bit short though. Stuck against this balcony break here. Dojin got his space away very slowly and patiently. I like it. Gets the wall flat. Big damage here. Right at about 50%. Gets a little more. Side step four once again. And here we go. Engage. Look yeah. at the sparks flying. Yeah, it chipping away, building up that great health. Double running two though. Wow, look at this offense from Dojin, oh where he gosh. is just running away with it against Al. Yeah, the low pokes are paying off now because we saw those back ones established at the very beginning of the set. A little quick sidestep this time around. Dojin looking in control. Back one catches the sidestep. Boom! Oh, the hop kick. Teaching him a lesson right there. Tries to go for a low, gets hit by the hop kick. And look at that, all the way to the wall. Uses the heat. Oh, big damage. Nice spring kick here from Al. Shoe shot. Gets clipped. Wait a minute. Al not out of it yet. What a series right here. Yeah, heat first activation for Al now. Got to be careful that heat smash. You know he might throw it out. He threw it out a second ago too. Okay. The destruction stands Bro. once again. Heat dash. Look at the chip. Look at the gray. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. In trouble. And there uh -huh. he goes. Sneaks one in. Al stops the rounds. Gets one on his side. This is still game number one. Yeah, you know, he used that heat first activation to really use the chainsaw to build up more chip damage than usual. Uh-uh. Al starting to get the speed of Dojin's game. Breaks this throw. Trying to get a reaction. Yeah, Dojin. Al playing simple. Yeah, Dojin looking pretty good right now, though. You know, he's out poking Al, and he's also out spacing Al for the most part. Jab time is looking good. Look at his shoulder. What a challenge. Mm -hmm. Look, nice delay. Gets the activation. Engage. Goes for the sprinkler. The lows. Oh, wow. Heat dash. Wow. Activates heat finally. Dojin with the Claudio. Okay. Got him. Game number one. That's going to be Dojin with the Claudio. Do we get a character switch from Al, though? Yeah, Al really got to consider this here. Obviously, first to two until we get into the top three of this tournament. So Al has to make a big choice with either sticking with that Elisa or maybe switching it up to that Victor. And double down there, giving Al some words of wisdom. Okay. Interesting. Double, another one of these international players that I was talking about that traveled so far. Mm -hmm. Definitely one of the players that was in strong contention to be in this very top eight. Oh, yeah, I think he got ninth or 13th. Yeah, yeah, he I was think right ninth. there. Yeah, I think Joker took him out at the end. Joker, another player in this top eight. The coach is back to back, actually, man. We got K Wiss, we got Joker, and mm -hmm. coaching each other all weekend. The Pakistani players are also coaching each other all weekend. Yeah, that's super sick, right? We see the, the regional diversity and even like the coaches team up, like the regional rivalries building in the tournament. It's like, I know we're in this top eight together. We might be opponents, but when you're up, I got your back. Yeah, yeah. I feel like it's become more and more of a thing now, man. There's just been so many more players who have like a designated player that they should talk to. I mean, we've seen Trungi come up. We've seen Atif come up. We've seen Arslan come up at times at other events as well. So. Might be smart to have a, a coach on backup, man. Somebody you know is not going to come up there and just go in here and be like, yo, man, I just really wanted to be on camera right now. <laughs> All right, I'm out of here. Keep doing what you're doing. I don't even know that guy. And now sticking it out with the Elisa. All right, here we go. Game two. Fallen destiny. <laughs> Lots of talking in between that game right there. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. That's a lot of coaching from double. Let's see if it pays off. Game two. Dojin and Al. So I was talking about, man, the speed at which Dojin can play, going for the mids. Yeah, Dojin is doing a really good job of sidestepping out of Elisa's pokes. Mm-hmm. Oof. 
the mid. Running two. Quick pokes just in case Al Go. tries something sneaky. Big damage right here. Activates the heat. Al in trouble. This is winner's side. But you want to keep that momentum. Wow. Speaking of momentum, a perfect on the side of Dojin in this second game. Yeah, Dojin is playing great right yeah. now. I really like him on this Claudio. Mm -hmm. Makes him play a little slower. Not as bold, but still getting the job done. These slower moves. Big clipping counter hits. Yeah, nice set side step from Al there, but the throw counter hits still get the break. Wow. Oh, wow. Side step hop kick. Here comes Al. Still has heat. Engage. Mm -hmm. There's the activation and the low to close it out this time. Getting around a lot quicker on the board than last time. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, this is definitely a big poke battle. This side step's really a big factor here in the matchup so far. Yo, the third dimension, bro. It's a 3D fighting game. Yeah, Alisa definitely has one of the better side steps in the game. Now looking for that hop kick after sidestep. Dojin slowing down that offense just a bit more. Yeah, definitely throwing off the timing. And you can see he's got these little sidestep rights, and they have really paid off for him. Breaks the throw. Get off of me. Oh, yeah, man. They... Oh, mm -hmm. what a sidestep. Yeah, sidestep really right again. Positioning. Yeah, anytime Al is trying to use back one, Dojin had the sidestep right against it. Got oh. the heat. Engage to the hop kick from Al, though. What a read on the low. And still has heat. Huh? Gonna get to the wall, shouldn't be able to kill. The low, the sprinkler to close it out. Two round lead in this second game now. Al starting to get in the swing of things. Yeah, you can see his lateral movement is really picking up. Dojin really having to reassess it. Dojin has kind of stopped using the back ones, actually. And, and if you think about it, though, it's because Al's been doing nothing but backing up for the most part. Mm -hmm. Not really trying to size stuff to get away, and the positioning has typically been in his favor. So, Dojin, that is. So, he's had his back to that wall, but right now, Al with the two-round wow. lead goes for the Ranger, and that is going to hit. And it's going to be some pretty good damage as well. Life not completely low, but that's going to be the rest of Rage. Still has heat, so there's still great damage to be had. Let's see what the mix-up is. Yeah, but Al's already got his heat activated. There's the heat dash. Heat burst right back from Doja now. Shoe shine. Three what a piece. rounds straight on the end of this, last, this second match. And now we're going to a potential last game. Ooh. Well, it's definitely going to be the last game. Double. He's coming back. He's like, yo, good job. But now Doge has got to consider, right? I mean, we know he's got a bunch of characters. Mm -hmm. The Claudio, he definitely stopped using the back ones there. And I feel like Al has had a lot of success with the sidestep. So it's kind of odd, right? Because game one, we saw that back one established early. Yep. I feel like game two, we really didn't see much of it. And Oh, it is him. Why well, was you take off his shoes? My man's yeah, hitting Yeah, I told you. <laughs> My man's hitting full, full toes to Matt right now. Okay. Yeah. All right, all right. Yeah. A vote of confidence. High pressure situation, of course. You know, if you win this match, if you're in the top three guaranteed, so you're one match away at that point from qualifying for the Esports World Cup. Mm -hmm. And this is just the first of two, so it all comes down to one game right here. Man, the one game gamble. Yeah, this is pressure, man. So let's see what character Dojin chooses to go with. Yeah, we saw some of the Leroy out of him yesterday. I want to know what the thought process is. Like, yo, okay, so they did good this time. They did good against this. Why do I switch it up? Oh, 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 Imagine, you just straight up question mark random is it? That'd be crazy. My man just goes to random. The Paul, the Phoenix? another character mm. I felt like is underrepresented. I mean, it's a character that got a lot of buffs in the latest patch, but we haven't seen anyone really put him to the test yet. So hard to tell where that character really stacks up. I stick into the yeah. Claudio. All right, I like okay. this choice. All right. Last match between these two winner sides. Somebody's gonna go to their lower bracket. Somebody's gonna stay alive on the winner side. Let's go. Descent into subconsciousness. Three breakable floors. Gonna be easy. I don't know about all that. Yeah, I'm about to say. Let's see if the back ones are back in the game. Oh my gosh! Wow. Going for the mid. Nose Dojin was actually ducking a lot early in that there first we game. Go. There it is. The back one's back in the game. Sidewalk hop kick. Here comes Al. 
Oh, the sprinkler oh, goes man. for the low. Down jab to interrupt your dojin. Trying to survive, finds the heat engager, gets a ton of health back with it. Going for the mid. Delay on Punish. the string. What? Slow. Shoulder, the bait. He's got rage. He got dash. combo into rage art. Oh, that should be the round, actually. Yo, this guy, Dojin, take biting his time in so many instances. It just looked like I was running away offensively, and Dojin just seemed like he was on the ropes the whole time. I mean, just that was, was waiting. A, a clutch heat engager and getting that health back so important to winning that round. And Dojin still got the sidestep rights right now. Going for the low strings, trying to get Dojin to do something crazy. Try to swing. Mm -hmm. Does those back ones. Oh. Seems like it was a major part. Oh. Standing four. Yeah, it's a homing attack, too. Mm, going to the lows. Stick it to the mids once again. Dojin has been on the ropes. The offense have definitely been on the side of Alpha along the... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good nice block. block. Uh-oh. Calls wow. it out. Put yes. the walls in the way here, I think. Do it again. It's hella not in the way. Heat dash combo. Don't the, even need it. The wall's not in the way. It's helping the way. Oh, boy. Dojin's got heat and rage. Ah, the wow. Rolls. Okay. Final game here. One round apiece. All right. Literally clawing and scratching for the round. One apiece. Clawing and scratching with the chainsaws. Chipping away at that gray life. Back mm -hmm. one again. A little delay. Catches to the wall. You ducking. Doesn't get the tornado. Uh oh. And you can see the side step left from Dojin to keep that wall behind Al. Running to oh. it to the range out of my own. And it's going to be counter hit damage. Not a lot of great life up there, but definitely going to get it back. This is not going to kill, but it is going to take a pretty penny. Yeah, we're all caught up, basically. Al also has heat ready to activate as well. And there it is. There's the heat first. Dojin in trouble. Oh, boy. Has to do it with all. Oh. Don't run into it in your face. Set point for Dojin. Trying to stay alive on this winter side. What are you going to do? Didn't even break a floor. Al coming alive here. Breaks the throw. Hands off. Tracking the normal throw right there. Mm -hmm. Back one once again. Running to engage on the heat. Big Ooh. lead here, Al. Needs to find a way back. Side step and that, that might be enough. Do it. The wall is there and it's not going to stop the combo. Dojin stays alive on this winner's side. The upper part of the bracket wow. is still something that he can be champion out of. But I'm going to go down to that loser's side. That Claudio came in clutch there. The back ones returned in game number three. And Dojin playing out of his mind, really, you know, played so safe, so compact. Really a simple game plan there. Using the back ones to establish the neutral. Then opening up with the low pokes. I was trying, you know, to guess, make some reads on the low pokes. He had a couple of them. But overall, you know, Dojin just outplayed.